Hey YouTube, it's Sabriana. So Valentine's Day is in less than a week. Now this was supposed to be uploaded on Friday, but KK's an idiot and she lost her phone. So I'm gonna beat her up after this video. Um, I couldn't beat her up beforehand because then she wouldn't let me borrow her camera or her channel. So it's gonna have to be after the video. So you better watch out KK. Just warning you ahead of time. But anyway, like I was saying, me and M Super decided to make a really cool Valentine's Day video, the video you're watching right now, obviously. And it's the ultimate guide to Valentine's Day. I'm gonna be teaching girls how to get guys to ask them to be their Valentine. And he's gonna be asking, and he's gonna be telling guys how to ask girls to be their Valentine. It's gonna be super cool. So you should stick around and watch the entire video no matter what gender you are, because it's gonna be super awesome. And plus, if you're a boy, you get to see my gorgeous face the whole time. So that should be a reason right there. But anyway, let's get started. Step one, you wanna make sure you look and smell really good because looks are everything and personal hygiene is important. So for looks, you just wanna copy me. That means pigtails, bright pink makeup, and girly shirts like this one. And to smell good, you wanna cake on deodorant like all over your body. Well, not all over your body, just your armpits. Um, your armpits should look like this wall behind me. Um, if it does, you know you're doing it right because you do not want your armpits to sink if you lift them up. And also, you just wanna spray perfume everywhere. I like to use tons and tons of different ones. And then you just spray it in front of you and walk through it. And you want to use tons of different ones, like I do, because then, you know, it'll get, like, a bunch of different smells, and they'll all combine. And it'll smell like love. So, yeah, it's, it's good advice. You should listen to it. Step two, you want to flirt a lot, because that'll make you seem adorable and single, just like me. JK, I have, like, five boyfriends right now. I'm not joking. I'm dating five different guys right now. None of them know, because... I'm really, you know, stealthy like that. And even if they did find out, I'd just flirt my way out of it. See, flirting can get you out of anything, except for, like, police. That's that's not good. Don't, don't flirt your way out of police situations. That's not a good idea. They'll probably see right through it. So flirting will get you out of any situation, except for things that deal with the government and police force. And it'll get you into a relationship, sweetie. So you should probably do it. Step three, force. Now, this is the most effective method. Here, let me demonstrate on KK's little brother, Herman. Would you be my valentine? No. Please? No, definitely not. Be my valentine or this knife will go through your skull. Okay, okay, fine. See? Super effective. Now, I'm gonna hand the camera over to M Super because it's his turn, but I'll be back for the outro, I promise. Thanks, Sabriana. Sup, everyone, I'm M Super. You might recognize me from KK's Thanksgiving Corrupt. That was an epic holiday dog, so you should probably go check that out if you haven't seen it, because... That was a great rap, if I do say so myself. But anyway, I'm a huge chick magnet, so you should probably listen to everything I say here. Unless you want to be alone on Valentine's Day, because then you could just do the exact opposite of what I tell you to do. Step one, attract her attention by buying expensive stuff. Like these $100 sunglasses, $50 sweatshirt, $200 headphones, and this cheap $5 chili pepper necklace from Walmart. Now this will tell her that you can take her on fancy dates and buy her Gucci purses and you still won't go broke. Not even close, dog. Trust me, it works. And don't buy cheap knockoff brands. She'll know the difference. These girls shop it everywhere. They know the difference between cheap stuff and the expensive. Step two. You want to use these good pickup lines. Now, I don't know if that's actually what it's called. I'm too cool to look it up, so just deal with it, okay? So, I'm good at these, and these, because I'm witty and smart and funny, so you should probably use these and come up with some on your own. So, the first one is, did you fall in lava? Because with all that fake tan, it looks like you've got a second-degree burn. And the second one is not mine. It's actually from this really cool guy named Max No Sleeves. So, what up, Max No Sleeves reference? Premature referencing. What up? And it is, did you fall from heaven? Because it looks like you just hit the sidewalk. These will make you look witty and funny. So, make sure to use them. Step three. When you ask her, you want to make sure you're confident. You just want to walk up and be like, yo, you're hot. Want to be my valentine? And if that doesn't get you chicks, then I don't know what will. Works for me, but that's also because I'm a rich rapper. So that certainly helps. And if that doesn't work, just ask really shy and nervous. Because for some reason, girls seem to find that cute. So either way works. But anyway, I'm going to give the can back to Sabriana because she's blowing up my phone. 
here asking me to, uh, you know, give her the camera back because she says I'm using too much time. So, I don't know when I'm going to be back because I've got a lot of rapping stuff going on. So, I'm going to give the camera back to Sabriana now because she has told me that she's going to spread rumors about me if I don't give it back to her. So, peace, dogs. KK said I couldn't do the full outro, which I thought I could do, but apparently I can't. She has such, like, mixed whatever. I don't even know what she does. But anyway, she has to do, like, this comment question thing, so I was like, sure, just go ahead. I don't really care. And, um, yeah, thanks for watching the whole video. I know you love seeing my gorgeous face, but if you're a girl, um, I guess you like seeing M Super's hot face? I don't know. But... Anyway, I have to go because there's actually a lineup outside the door of boys who are waiting me to waiting to ask me to be their Valentine. So I'm gonna go say yes to all of them and date all of them at one time. So I have a lot to do. So bye guys. I love all of you. What up everyone? KK Breezy in the house. So last week's comment question was, "What do you like about being sick?" On my video, "What I like about being sick," and the person who answered, there was only one person who actually answered, but I did get a lot of comments on that. And it was the Junjun Jun 2003, and they said, I like that I could stay on the computer when I'm sick, and I don't like that when you come back to school the next day, you have loads more homework and regular work. I actually don't get sick very often. My immune system's pretty strong. I probably just jinxed it there. I'm bad at that. <laughs> um, I jinx myself a lot, actually. Um, so I don't really know what that's like, and I happened to get sick on a day when I didn't have any subjects that gave homework. Um, the only academic subjects I have on that day are Spanish and history. Other than that, I just have, um, like, technology education and gym. So, I didn't really miss that much, so I got lucky on that. But this week's comment question, um, I'm gonna be announcing that in another video because I want to quick make an updates video because I have a lot of stuff to update you guys on. And it's too long for me to put at the end of the video. So I'm going to announce the question in the other video. So I really hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please like, comment, and subscribe. I make new videos every weekend. That's Friday through Sunday, in case you did not know. And please do the same for Smoothie CP and Skater Face Gaming. Um, I'm going to go make that other video now. So see you guys next time. Bye.